Pullman Model H Light Touring 1908. 20 horsepower, 165.7 cubic inches L head and line 4 cylinder engine, 3 speed manual transmission, solid front axle and livier axle with semi elliptical leaf springs, and 2 wheel mechanical drum brakes. Wheelbase, 100 inches. In 1903, Albert Brummel, a York, Pennsylvania inventor, constructed a two cylinder, six wheeled car with equally spaced axles. He called it Pullman, after the comfortable railroad sleeping cars, and the theory was that extra axles would give more comfort. Instead, the arrangement proved extremely impractical, since the front and rearmost axles would, on bumpy roads, occasionally leave the ground, the car could become stranded. His one prototype was reportedly disassembled, and Brummel moved on to other ventures. Early in 1905, he teamed with Samuel Bailey, a carriage builder, to test the market for a new car, to be called York, the Pullman name having fallen into disgrace. The enlisted James Klein, a mechanic from nearby Harrisburg, and formed the York Motor Car Company. The first cars were demonstrated at 1905's York County Fair by which time the Pullman name had been resurrected. They were big, expensive cars, selling for upwards of $1,850, with shaft drive and engines from 20 to 40 horsepower, at a time when a Ford could be bought for $600. Runabouts and touring cars were offered, on wheelbases of 93 to 103 inches, and they sold reasonably well for the time, though annual production never breached 5,000 units. This car, the oldest restored Pullman known to survive, was purchased by the owner's father from historian and collector Fred Rosenmiller of York, Pennsylvania, where the car was built. Although the restoration was done quite a few years ago, it was done to show standards, and the car has been carefully maintained and stored in the intervening years. The engine and transmission have been rebuilt, and the car runs and drives well. It was awarded an Alka Grand National First Prize in 1997 and given preservation status the following year. In 2005, it earned a Palmetto Award at the Hilton Head Concord Elegance in South Carolina. Other noteworthy appearances have been at the York Heritage Trust Concord in its hometown, and at the Invitational Amelia Island and Pebble Beach Concord. Although now an older restoration, the car presents well. The light gray body contrasts nicely with deep red buttoned leather upholstery, highlighted by brass lamps and radiator shell. The black canvas top is in very nice condition, and a wicker humper is strapped to the rear. The undercarriage is clean and painted body color, the engine compartment is tidy and correctly detailed. There is no instrumentation, save for a dashboard mounted key wind clock. The brake and clutch pedals are cast brass and labeled and the car carries its original serial number plate, Selden patent plate, and a century-old vehicle plaque from the Harceless Carriage Club of America. Pullman production for 1908 was 873 cars. The odds of there being another survivor, in any condition, are very, very slim, making this Pullman a near-unique acquisition.